Hello everyone, today I want to explain what is a surface tension. Surface tension is the property of the surface of a liquid that allows it to resist an external force due to the cohesive nature of its molecules. The cohesive force between liquid molecules are responsible for the phenomenon known as a surface tension. You see water molecules create bond with the surrounding water molecules. But for the surface layer, you see there is no water molecules above to create a bond. So it creates stronger bonds with the neighbors. A liquid that has large intermolecular forces has high surface tension. The hydrogen-hydrogen bond in water has very high energy and therefore the water has high surface tension compared to other liquids. The surface tension of water is about 72 mN per meter at room temperature which is one of the highest surface tension for liquid. There's only one liquid having high surface tension and that's mercury, which is liquid metal with a surface tension of almost 500 millinewton per meter. Some example or cases of surface tension. Moving water striders over water surface. You see this, uh, water striders can stand and move over the surface of water. Also floating needle. You see this needle floating over the water which has a density higher than the uh, water. Just if you break the surface layer, it submerges it, as you see. Another case, drop of a liquid. You see water drop get a spherical shape due to surface tension. It tries to have a minimum surface area. Capillary action. Capillary action also belongs to the surface tension. We will discuss this phenomena in a special tutorial. Unit of surface tension is force per unit length, Newton per meter, or energy per unit area, like joules per meter square. The surface tension of a liquid is an intrinsic property, depending upon its temperature, composition, and molecular activity. The surface tension decreases with an increased temperature due to the weakening of cohesive forces as a result of increased thermal activity between molecules. Let us solve some examples. For water droplet, for example, we have this water droplet. Consider a spherical droplet having a diameter d and internal pressure p. The surface tension on the droplet is given by the surface tension formula. We have this formula for water droplet. Surface tension equal to pressure multiply diameter over 4. For example, surface tension of water is 0.072 Newton per meter. What is the excess pressure inside a water drop if the diameter is 1.2 millimeter? That is the formula we have. If we want to find pressure, it will be pressure will be 4 multiply surface tension of drop over D. Just put the data you get the result, it equals 240 Newton per meter square. Another case, for example, soap bubble. Estimate the surface tension on the soap bubble having an inside to outside pressure difference of 2.5 Pascal and a diameter of 40 millimeter. We have this formula for soap bubble. Surface tension of bubble equal to pressure multiply diameter over eight. If you just put the data, it will be this two this meter cancels this one so the result will be 0 0.0125 newton per meter that's all i hope it can be helpful have a nice time